Hello viewers, welcome to my channel. I'm Hashem Ali Khan. Last two videos I have completed four problems on computation of income from house property. In this video, fifth and sixth, two more problems I want to explain you in detail. So if you want the perfect knowledge, watch all the videos from beginning till and don't skip in between. So before starting the fifth problem, I expect my viewers to have a printout of the problems which I have given in the link under my description. Take the screenshot of the points of fifth and sixth problem, then I'll explain. On 1st April 2022, Mr. Manohar purchased a house in Hyderabad for residential purpose. For rupees 23 lakhs, uh, uh, for his he took he, a loan of 10% from Central Bank of India. So he has purchased a house for residential purpose, and the cost of the house was 23 lakh, which he took a loan at 10%. That means interest on loan will be allowed as deduction under Section 24B, which has been let out to Mr. K R Reddy on a monthly rent of 20,000. So 20,000 into 12, 2 lakh 40,000 is the annual rent the house was occupied throughout the year the municipal valuation uh, is rupees 1 lakh 20 thousand municipal tax is 10 percent standard rent 1 lakh 50 thousand so actually owner is mr manohar and the tenant is k r reddy so municipal taxes are 10 percent on what on municipal rental value the municipal taxes are based on municipal rental value Municipal rental value 1 lakh 20,000. 10 percent 12,000 is the municipal taxes. Standard rent is given. That means the house is governed by Rent Control Act. Standard rent is given. So we have to calculate adjusted ERV. Mr. K R Reddy could have obtained a similar house at a rent of 14,000 per month. This is the fair rental value. During the year, Mr. K R Reddy did not pay the rent for March and vacated the house. That means for the month of March, last month. He has not paid the rent and he has vacated the house. That means it's an unrealized rent. There is difference between outstanding rent and unrealized rent. Outstanding rent means rent is due but not paid. He will pay it in future. But unrealized rent means when the tenant has not paid the rent and vacated the house. That means it is not realizable. It's a bad debt. Compute income from house property. So simple. So, owner is Mr. Manohar. Mr. Manohar, computation of income from house property for the assessment year 23-24. Same format. GAV minus municipal taxes, NAV less deductions 24, income from house property. That is the same format will be applied every problem. The only thing, GAV will be calculated in working notes, gross annual value. This GAV will be calculated by considering MRV, FRV, ARV, SRV. Four rental values. The first step, Calculating ERV, expected rental value, which is higher of the following two, MRV, FRV. In the problem, it is given MRV 1 lakh 20 thousand and fair rental value, rent of similar house in the same locality is 1 lakh 68 thousand. How? 14 thousand into 12. So whichever is higher is the ERV. So ERV is 1 lakh 68 thousand. Second step, adjusted ERV. This step is required if the house is governed by Rent Control Act. If SRV is given, then only this step. So adjusted ERV is least of the following two, ERV or SRV. ERV we already got 1,68,000. Standard rental value is given in the problem 1,50,000. Whichever is lower is the adjusted ERV. So lower is 1,50,000. So we got adjusted ERV. Now ARV actual rental value <clears throat> rent of 12 months so 20,000 per month 20,000 per month into 12 2 lakh 40,000 but the last month March month he has not paid the rent and vacated the house it's an unrealized rent so minus 20,000 rent of 12 months minus unrealized rent this is the new point so direct 20,000 2 lakh 20,000 is the ARV actual rental value now finally, GAV is higher of the following two amounts, X adjusted ERV or ARV. 
adjusted ARV we got 1,50,000 and ARV we got 2,20,000 whichever is higher is the GAV 2,20,000 first step completed 2,20,000 is the GAV from that municipal taxes it is given municipal taxes are 10% of MRV MRV is how much 1,20,000 the 10% of 1,20,000 12,000 deduct 12,000 you will get 2,8,000 as the NRV Net, uh, net annual value, NAV, net annual value. Now two deductions are allowed in section 24, 24A, 24B, 24A standard deduction, compulsory deduction, 30% of NAV, 30% of 28,000, 6,200. Second one is interest on loan. The SSC has taken a loan of 23 lakh, first line it is given, 23 lakh loan, on which 10% is the rate of interest. So 10% of 23 lakh, it comes to 2 lakh 30,000. Now add up both directions, 2 lakh 92, 400, deduct. So 2 lakh 8,000 minus 2 lakh 92, 400, you are getting negative figure. That means loss from house property. 84,400 is a loss from house property. That's it. Now come to the sixth problem. In every problem, almost 90% points are same. Only one or two points are different. So you have to focus on those one or two points. And always I ask you to maintain running notes. Whatever provisions I'm explaining, immediately note it down so that in the coming problems, you don't find any difficulty. Sixth problem, Mrs. Sandhya of 45 years of age owns a house which was let out to Mrs. Devi on a rent of 10,000 per month. SSC, owner of the house is Sandhya and the tenant is Devi. The monthly rent is 10,000. Municipal value of its house is 1 lakh and fair rental value 1 lakh 10,000. Standard rent 75,000. Again, the house is governed by Rent Control Act because SRV is given. Now, uh, Mrs. Devi did not pay the rent of July and so made to vacate on 31st July 2022. This tenant, Mrs. Devi, she has not paid the rent for July. So she has paid the rent for April, May, June. Only three months she has paid. In the month of July, she has not paid and vacated the house. It is unrealized rent. One month rent is unrealized. How much? 10,000. 10,000 is the unrealized rent. And on 1st August, as soon as she has vacated the house, immediately on 1st August, she let out the house to Mrs. Shanti on a rent of 9,000 per month. The new tenant is Miss Shanti. The 9,000. First four months are over. So remaining eight months, the tenant is Shanti and the actual rent is 9,000 per month. Expenses incurred during the previous year, repairs, ignore, not allowed as reduction. Municipal taxes, 15,000, allowed as reduction. Interest on loan taken to construct the house, 70,000, allowed as reduction. Compute income from house property. First of all, Mrs. Sandhya is the owner. Computation of income from house property for the assessment year 23-24. Make the format as usual. Then we compute the GAV. The gross annual value. The house is governed by Rent Control Act. So adjusted ERV also we have to calculate. ERV is higher of the following two. MRV and FRV. MRV is 1 lakh. FRV is 1 lakh 10,000 given. So higher 1 lakh 10,000 is the ERV. Expected rental value. Now we need adjusted ERV, that is a list of the following two, ERV or SRV. So ERV is 1,10,000, SRV standard rental value is 75,000 given in the problem, whichever is lower, 75,000 is the adjusted ERV. Now we calculate ARV. First four months, Mrs. Devi. Next eight months, Mrs. Shanti. So Mrs. Devi, four months. So what is the rental value per month? 10,000. So 10,000 into 4. Then plus 9,000 into 8. So 12 months rent. So 10,000 into 4, 40,000. And 9,000 into 8, 72,000. Minus one month unrealized rent. Because the old owner, tenant, that is Devi, she has not paid the rent for July and vacated. That means unrealized rent for one month. How much? 10,000 minus 10,000. So 1 lakh 2,000 is the ARV. Now finally, GAV is higher of the following two. Adjusted ERV or ARV. 
adjusted ERV is 75,000 we have calculated here and ARV we have calculated 1,2,000 which over is higher 1,2,000 is the GAV gross annual value from GAV direct municipal taxes it is given in the problem municipal taxes are 15,000 so 15,000 municipal taxes deduct we get NAV net annual value section 24A standard deduction 30% of NAV 26,100 and interest on loan it is given in the last line of the problem 70,000 take the total 96,100 subtract then we we'll get 9,100 negative figure again loss the so loss from house property 9,100 so this is the end of problem number 6 totally 6 problems I have explained inshallah we will continue the next problem in the next video